Welcome back. In this lesson, we are going to talk about pipelines. Sometimes you will have uh, stages for, let's say, products, but you will have different stages for a service. As an example, for a service, you might have lead coming in as a new opportunity, and it will be in qualification process. And then you need to hold a meeting with this person. And then you're sending a proposal, and then you create an estimate, and then you send the estimate. All that will be for a service. For a product, you might have an integration with your Shopify or your WordPress. And whenever the Shopify takes place, it will automatically be close one or close lost. So you will have only two stages. Okay? So let's see how that works. How you do that? If you will go to the settings, you will have under customization, you will have the pipelines. If you click on pipelines, you can see that you can create new pipelines. And every pipeline, the pipeline that you create, you will be able to assign specific stages to it. So in my case, I will have close one and close lost. Okay. So whenever I will have a Shopify purchase, I can automatically set it as close one. And whenever someone goes to create a card and is abandoning the card, I will make it as close lost. And that can be automatically done. So the bottom line is, is based on the pipeline, you will have different pipe type of stages. You see, so in this case, it will be, for example, a short Shopify purchase. And now I will have only two stages, close one and close loss. Okay. Majority of the businesses are overcomplicating things. They will have many pipelines. The idea is not to have a pipeline for each product. The idea is to have a pipeline for each group of products or group of services. As an example, if I am selling in my business, I will sell, for example, packages, and I will also sell per hour consulting, and I will also sell training services, and fixed price projects. Even though those are completely different, I will have only one pipeline for all of them because all of them will have a qualification process, an intro meeting, a second meeting to demo the product, a price proposal, an agreement being signed, and only then I'm asking for the payment details on file, the credit card on file. All of them will follow exactly the same process. So even though I have different products and services, I am still following the same processes and therefore I will have only one pipeline with the same stages for all those products. So you will need to think about your business, you will need to break it to pieces and you will need to think of how many pipelines do you really need for your business and what will be the stages for each pipeline. And based on that, you can go to the system and start adding those. But before you know exactly what are the stages and pipelines, do not work on the system. It's a waste of time because you are going to confuse yourself and your employees. Thank you for watching the lesson. If you'd like to know more about us, we are Amazing Business Results. We are a Zo Premium Partner and we offer a few services. One service will be Custom Zo Development. That means that you're coming with your own business problems and we'll find the right Zo solutions for your needs. We also develop extensions. Those extensions will be applications that we created that are plug and play to your Zo system. And each one of, of those extensions will solve a specific business problems for your needs. We are also a Ring Central reseller, which means we can sell you the Ring Central system, which is a phone and text message system. And because you're buying it from us, we'll give you the license to use our extension for free for one year. 